Hello! Okay, today, um, today's video is on how to purchase a domain name in Australia. Now I use crazydomains.com.au but there are heaps of Australian resellers. Um, the registrar I think of Australian domain names is melbourneit.com.au um, but they also sell domain names at a premium so um, you can find them a lot cheaper elsewhere. So go to dom um, crazydomains.com.au First of all you'll want to see if your domain name is available so we'll type in um, any or well, just as a test so say I wanted testingdomain.com.au click search and this will actually tell me if it's available so that's not available so we can go up the top here and type in another domain name, click search and that's available and it's ticked so it's twelve dollars and add that to the cart I'll add a previous one in there so we'll just untick that that's the one I want now if you're new to crazy domains you'll need to create a account so complete that and then click on continue order but I have an account login and for Australian domains we have to take it for a minimum of two years so that's a $24 now this is where they do the add-ons so do you want to add on a DNS upgrade if you don't, if you do, you just tick that box, and it'll cost you twelve dollars. But I don't want that, so I'll just click continue. Another add-on here is privacy protection. You can tick that. Add-on seven dollars, but I'll leave it blank. Continue. Same with promoting your domain. If you want it, tick it. If not, continue order. Now if you want to host, you want hosting with this, this is where your your website will sit, the files for your website. But we don't need that, so we're just going to go continue to order. Now because we're buying a .com.au, we have to confirm that we are a registered business or company that is able to purchase that particular domain name so there's got to be some sort of connection between your business name or company name and the domain name that you're buying um, for instance if it was XYZ bookkeeping Australia and your .com.au and your business or company name was um, XYZ proprietary limited that would be fine it doesn't have to be exactly the same but as long as they can, they can see that there's some correlation between the domain name and your business or company name so you'll need an ABN, an ACN or one of the registered business name numbers put that in there and your business name your registered business name and the business type whether it's a company or registered business most of us will probably be registered business and once you've completed that um, you click confirm I won't do that because I don't really want to buy that <laughs> domain um, and what it could take a couple of minutes or it could take a couple of days because they'll have to confirm the information that you've put in here is um, is correct then you'll get an email from them saying that you now own a domain name so they'll give you all the instructions to to use to go from there okay so that's how to purchase a domain name 